Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geek of Iron Pendulum, welcome back to Train Station Simulator. So, last time we have had far more success than we did on our first playthrough of this ever, because it's actually working. Look, we've got people coming in, there's a bustling station, it doesn't have any walls because the walls are still a little bit broken in this game, but that's fine, we don't need walls. Where we're going, we don't need walls. So look, profits are good, 36,000 on tickets. 13,000 on vending, 50 grand in total. We spent a bit on buildings. For some reason, we're not paying any salaries. I'm not entirely sure why that is. But a bank loan, we've got to pay that off because we took a loan out last time. Why are we not paying any salaries? That's a bit weird, isn't it? It's a little bit strange. Okay, all oh, right, okay. Okay, thugs. Thugs have appeared. What time is it? 7.30 p.m. So, Butch T. Butch T should be on duty. In fact, is that Butch T? Can we find Butch T? Is that Butch T wandering off? Yeah, brilliant. So the one time when there's villains, there are hoodlums in our station, you have decided to wander away. Look, they're just here. They're just here. I can see him. He's in his vest. He's in a vest. Butch, come on, Butch. Come on, Butch. Do your job, man. Do your job. You've got one job, and that's to defend this place from baddies, from naughty people. Uh, okay, they're not vandalising anything though, I don't think, at the minute. They're not vandalising anything. They just come in to scout out the place, perhaps. Hang on. He might be going over to one of these. Is he going to start attacking my vending machines? No, they, they've just evaporated. So the police presence maybe put them off, which is splendid news. Okay, we're going to hire another one because we want to have one. Uh, Annie S is on from 7 until 3. Bush is on from 3 till midnight. Nobody is on between midnight and 7. We need another person. So do we hire Bill T, who collects stamps, or do we hire Clara M, who worked at the Grand Central Terminal as a security advisor? I think we hire Clara M. That makes a lot of sense, doesn't it? So she starts at midnight and ends at 7 a.m. So Clara with midnight till 7, Annie is 7 till 3, Butch is 3 till midnight. There we go. And there we go. Cool. That's good. Oh, Butch is a little bit sad. Let's 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 give him a bit more salary. There we go. Fine. Give him four hundred and fifty dollars. That's absolutely fine. So, we've got have we got one of those? Yes, we have one of these that keeps people alive. Now we can only have two of these, so they're going to have to work twelve-hour shifts, I think. So maybe if we do them seven till seven and give them a big bunch of monies, how do we improve their mood? I don't know. A uh, new timetable is available. Okay, I've got to do my timetable at some point. Is my timetable okay? Uh, oh, no, it, it's completely undone itself. Let's just pick the one which gives us the most trains at this moment in time. There we go. Fine. Uh, right. People. People. Where was I? Back to employees. No, stop following that person. <laughs> employees. So, yeah, you're doing 7 till 7 in... So, 7 a.m. until 7 p.m. And you... No, but the people aren't here until then, though, are they? People... It's like 6 until... Uh, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1... Let's put him until 1. And let's hire James K. 27-year-old single guy from Long Island. He worked at the local hospital for three years. Let's get him from 1 until... What time are people here? Sort of 11-ish? Midnight? Uh, okay, let's let's push that like that. There we go. So we've got police people here all the time. Medics people here all the time. Uh, Dennis T can just do his job whenever. He still hasn't fixed that thing. I don't know how I'm supposed to make him fix that, to be perfectly honest. I don't know how to fix it. I really don't know how to fix this thing here. It, it's never, it's not being repaired at all. I don't know. And we have three cleaners. So they are covering, uh, they do the early shift. They do uh, three till 11 and you do 11 to eight. So we've kind of got two in the middle of the day. I think employees wise, that's fine. So the big thing we were doing last time was building some tracks. We were building tracks. So let's see if we can get this going. We've been paid. We've got eighty-seven and a half thousand dollars now. So we should be able to build tracks. Now, is that where we want them to go? I think we want one more track like that to make this match and then an end thing. Fifteen grand for a buffer stop. Good grief. Right. Platform four is in. Platform four is in. Okay, right. Let's demolish the trees. Farewell, nature. We have no need of you here. Progress is coming. Destroy the trees. In fact, destroy... Do you know what? Can we zoom out? Can we just... Does it cost us anything to destroy a tree? 
No, it costs us nothing. Goodbye, trees. <laughs> Why keep the trees? If they're not going to do anything. Let's just get rid of them. Let's just zone out a gigantic thick. Yeah, so let's do that. Look to there. Kill all the trees. And then, and then kill all the trees like there to there, like so. Bosh. Sorted. All the trees are out of the way. Splendid. The only tree we have is a Christmas tree, which is fine. Okay, now we want to build around here. So let's get a let's get our floor tiles in place. Because now we can build more train station. Yes, this is going to be good. Right, okay, so we had four last time, didn't we, from the edge. So one, two, three, four. So yeah, so how far how wide is this? How wide is this bit here? Because I kind of want to repeat this. I want it to look kind of consistent, I suppose. Oh, no. Or Shall I just bring those ones in? Bring tracks 6, 7, and 8 in too. 5, 6, 7, and 8. So bring 5 in. Five. How far away is track 5? No, I'm going to have these shorter again. Tracks 5 and 6 can be shorter. And the 7 and 8 can be longer again. So for the minute, that is fine. So now, we need to stick some platform on the side. Uh, up to the end just there. I don't know quite why we've got it on the end, but never mind. So like that, rotate it round like so. So now we have an actual platform. I don't have enough money, apparently. I don't know quite know what for. I've zoned that thing out. That's fine, isn't it? Is that not fine? That looks fine to me. Let's zone a bit there as well. And you know what? Let's zone that and that and that. And then get some regular flooring and zone that just there as well. Because why the heck not? Okay, so now we've got another... So we've got track four in play. So next time, on the next day, I should be able to then go to track four and set some trains for that and have double the amount of trains coming, essentially. Because that's kind of how this is going to work. Okay, so let's speed time on. Because it's only early in the morning at the minute. So let's hurry time on until the end of the day. And see where we are. Oh, oh, oh. Someone's being brought back to life. Someone's being brought back to life. Where was that? Where were you, medical miracles man? Oh, up there. Oh. Oh, okay. You're up there. Who are you? Dennis. Dennis is our... He's one of them. Why is Dennis just stood there? You please, please come amend things, Dennis. Dennis. Okay, let's dismiss Dennis. A, a thousand, it's fine. Just dismiss Dennis. Right, let's hire you instead. Let's hire Timothy C. Seven till three. And let's just get somebody in. Right, good. Finally. Someone might come in and mend the thing. So him there, I want him to go mend the big crack in the pavement. Because a great big crack in the pavement. I don't know where he's going. How do I, how do I tell them? Uh, come out of that. I don't want to follow you. To mend that. Oh. Oh, maybe I just fired someone for no reason. <laughs> Maybe I just fired someone for no reason. Hey, do you know what? Dennis, come back. <laughs> All is forgiven. All is forgiven, Dennis. No, you're not on quite yet. You can start at 3 until uh, closing. 12. That'll do. There we go. Fine. Now, how much money are we making today? 25 and a half grand. It's only 20 past 2. Right, hurry time on. Yep, let's get to the end of the day. Let's get paid. And then we should have to do something with that extra train track. Okay, so yesterday was a bit of a bumper day for everything by the look of it. Passenger-wise, I think this is the day we're looking at. That was yesterday. We got a lot of money. Oh, I'm following someone again. We got a lot of money, which is lovely, which is very good. Look at the tickets. That's the most we've ever had from ticket sales. Not quite the most income because vending didn't go quite as well as other days. But then look, we had other days. Two passengers had a medical emergency. One and one. <laughs> 19 passengers yesterday had medical emergencies. That's just a kind of a bit crazy right there. Uh, yeah, why has transit gone back down? Why has transit deteriorated? We had two stars for transit on day three and four. And on day five, transit has gone back down to not very much at all. As has information. Information has decreased. Maybe it's to do with the size of the, uh, the, size of the platform is relative to everything else. So maybe because... Oh, <laughs> a random bit of floor. Because it's now bigger... It needs more information points to kind of service it. Right, timetable. We need to get this done. So now we can have that one in, that one in, that one in. Or can we have that one in? Let's get commuter four. Uh, and then we can get national just there. Oh, okay, right. This is very clever. Okay, so we could have that coming into track four. Yeah, why not do that? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. 
So we can have lots and lots of things. Right, okay, that's good. That's good, I like that. So now we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine trains coming in. Yes, instead of whatever we would have had before, which would have been, what, five or six possibly? So that's good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, troublemakers. However, worry not because everyone's off duty. Hang on, what? Midnight, start midnight, end 7 a.m. Clara M, Clara M, start at midnight, <laughs> end at 7 a.m. You're supposed to be at work, Clara M. Where are you? This man is vandalising my, my equipment. The whole point was that you were there overnight. Oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> now they're just vandalising the machines. Oh, fine. Okay, yep, so we're going to lose probably lots of vending machine things. Um, okay, maybe we need to do that. Maybe we need to say start at... After midnight? No, she can't start at midnight. Okay, maybe you need to start at... 1am or something. Or is it... Is it... Ah. Uh, it's midnight at the start of the day rather than midnight at the end of the day. Okay, there's different midnights, everybody. Midnight is different. Okay, fine. Well, there we go. At least we've learned an important lesson about midnight. Okay, we need to put some more stuff around here then. So, we need some more benches and stuff. So, objects. So, let's put more things in because we need some more stuff. So, information boards are always good. Let's put one of those just there. Benches, let's have a big row of benches along here with a gap in the middle for people to get through. Oh, no, not like that. Like that. And then spin them round and let's just have loads and loads of benches the other side. Classic bench. You know, do the little flip, do the switch. Okay, an information point can be uh, at the end just there. Uh, what can we have? Mailboxes. Right, we need to repair those broken things. I think that's what we need to do. We need to delete that and delete that and put in the automated ticket machines, like so. Then, uh, facilities. Let's get ticket booths. Let's put some more in along here. So they're on that row, aren't they? So let's put some just... Uh, there's one directly at the end of the thing there. So let's put one there. And one there, and one there. There we go. Now, they're really expensive. I don't quite know why they're so expensive, but they are. Right, and then let's flip that round, pop those in to make it look all pretty. That's very nice. Uh, another Christmas tree. Why not? There we go. Drop a Christmas tree in for no discernible reason. Right, facilities. We might need some more restrooms at some point. Might drop them along here. Uh, possibly. Can we have a big block of them in the middle? Big block of restrooms in the middle looking good. Right, let's put some of these things in. An information stand, like we have just here. Let's drop another one in just there. And behind that, what can we put behind him? What can we put behind there? Uh, mailboxes. Yes, that's cool. Let's drop that in, like so. Uh, photo booth could go there. That's a nice thing to have. Also, a clock. Drop the clock next to the photo booth. Right. What other facilities can we have? A lounge bar we've already got. Yeah, so a food station is what we want next time. So let's... Uh, can we expand this bit out now? Let's try and bring this bit down. Build just here. Floor tiles like to there. So we're going to run out of money for now. So we've got $2,760. However, how much money have we made? Because now we have two lots of trains coming in. We should be making more money in theory. Right, let's speed time on because it's only two in the afternoon. Yeah, we're, we're not making as much money all of a sudden. No, we're not making as much money at all. So let's see if the money starts rolling in. Okay, right. A little bit more profit coming in. Paying some salaries. Why don't we pay any salaries on day five? A little bit strange, isn't it? I don't know why there were no salaries on day five. Okay, well, whatever. So, we've had more passengers than ever today, presumably because of the fact that we can get more trains. So, there we go. Oh, there's loads of people. There's loads coming in on these sort of later trains. No, not really many people getting that train on platform four. But okay, so we're not going to make as much money today, I don't think. Particularly in terms of vending. We're not making much vending monies. Come on, everybody. Pay up. Pay up. No, no one's buying any vending stuff. Yeah, they are. There we go. The vending stuff is slowly going up. 
tickets are a bit lower than I thought they would be, though, in fact. Yeah, they're significantly less. They're significantly less. Maybe that was the rejigging of the timetable, possibly. There we go. So now it's closed. All income's updated. So it's not like I'm shy of money, which is fine. So let's go to the timetable. Let's clear all these. Let's see if I can maximise this as much as I can. So let's have that one and that one like that. Now that eliminates those two. So can we do that? And that and that and that and that and that. Yes, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine trains. The only thing is, we don't have any commuter just here. I'm tempted to take off that city link and put commuter arrival at 6 30 pm, like that. There, I think that's good. I think that'll work. And that means, yeah, how many we've got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine trains. That's good. And now. We want to put in, where is it, facility. Oh, look, is that our security guy talking to the vandals? Is that our security guy scaring away the vandals? Go on, security guy or girl, whoever you are. Yeah, look, they've gone. Well done. Who's our employee? Who, who are you? Who's on duty? Clara M. Yeah, I won't mess with Clara M. Nails, mate. Right, I don't think I can afford to put that in. I wanted to put in the food station. It's 85 grand, and I can't do that. Which is annoying because uh, platform could do with a bit of a boost. Everything else is very good. Information, comfort and clean is very good. Platform and size, not so good. Okay, city transit. Now, do I need to do something with all these buses now to make sure that they're arriving at the right time? Or can I put one of those in? VIP national parking. Generates 20, 10 to 20 passengers per hour. Generate a uh, price 60 grand. It's vandal proof. Do I put one of these in? The thing is, they have to go all the way down here. So they have to go at the bottom, look, just here. But that would generate another 10 to 20 passengers per hour. And they can just walk in. It's absolutely fine. Should we put them in? How big is that one? Where can that go? So that can go just there. So yeah, we'd need to put the next one of those, I think, just there. Let's spend 30 grand on putting a commuter trolley stop in. Yeah. And that should then help. So this is commuter. So this is blue. This is blue trains. So what time are our blue trains? Uh, half five, half three, and half six. So half three. What was it again? <laughs> I've got no brain. Half five in the morning, so 5.30, 3.30, 6.30. So we want one at, is that when it arrives? One at five, uh, to get there for 5.30. One at 3.30 and one at 6.30. Like that, I think. But then if we can just put some in the middle for now anyway, like that. Just to make sure that people can get here. That's probably a good thing. That would be a good thing to have as well. An underground connection. I imagine that would be very beneficial. That would be quite cool. Okay, but right now, that's looking okay. We've got people buying tickets. We've got plenty of stuff going on. Oh, there's a great big hole in the floor. Can someone come and mend the hole in the floor, please? Employees, who's on? Timothy C is on duty. Timothy C... Come on, mend this whacking grey hole in the ground. Yep, repair state is nothing. So let's hurry time on. Uh-oh, vandals. I can hear vandals. An awful lot of vandals going on. They're running around. Yep, the police poop. Yes, the, the police are evaporating them. The police are... We've got one more. He's destroying the stuff. Police, <laughs> do your job. Yes, they have been dealt with. Yes. Okay, that was glorious. That was brilliant. That worked really well. Okay, do you know what? Let's just put time back to normal speed for a second. Let's get some objects. Let's buy another couple of the automated ticket machines like that. Splendid. Okay, that's good. And one thing I am going to do is build. We're going to have this all the way down to the end, aren't we? I don't think there's any argument there. So let's spend 6300 on that. And then... Let's just start bringing in three, just a little bit, and four. Look, they're going to come here. They're going to be shorter, so not enough money. It's very angry that I'm trying to do this. So, yeah, there we go. So we're going to bring these in, and they can just be shorter tracks. They can end just here. 
We still have a couple more things, a couple more tracks coming in. Then we'll have four, four tracks coming in. That'll be glorious. Uh, okay, so we've got no money. We've got no money. We're making plenty of money. Yes, we're making an alright amount of money, I think. Let's speed time on. Let's see how good we get. Nope, don't do that. Ideally, yeah, I want to get 85 grand. Might have to leave it quite a long time in order to get the two, the uh, food station. But do I get these two tracks in first or do I get one of the tracks in and have another train and have some more uh, trains available to then bring more profit in? I think that's probably what I'm going to do. Let's wait to the end of the day. Let's wait till I've been paid and then let's see how much money. Let's see how far we can get these tracks in. Right, okay, so I've been paid. I've got 73 grand. Yeah, that was a bit better than yesterday. Vending the previous day, vending on day seven was colossal. Right, okay, so timetable. Uh, let's do that for commuter. Then another commuter. Then, uh, yeah, that, that means we can't have this green one. I'd rather have that, I think. Then commuter, then national. Then national coming in on that one. Then city link. Then a commuter. And there's a big gap there. And then it doesn't really matter which one we choose. National just there. So that's fine for now. So now can I then get this option in? Standard train rails. They don't need to come all the way through to the end. If we can put that to say there and then stick an end stopper thing on it. Does that mean platform two is now functional? Can I use platform two? I could get that train in and that train in on platform two. So I can use platform two to get extra thing. Yes, look, I can get extra trains. Yes, okay, right, platform two. Right, people need to be able to go to platform two. Oh dear, uh, they, can, they can't go to platform two right now. Uh, or they might be able, I might be able to just shade it. There we go. <laughs> There's a very, very short platform for Platform 2 at the minute. It's a work in progress. It's fine. Right. There are an awful lot of holes in the place and nobody is mending them. I don't know why the maintenance guys aren't doing their job. I mean, it's not like they have particularly tricky jobs. One's three till midnight, one's seven till three. So there's no one on right now. I would expect them to be fixing these giant cracks in the ground. I don't know why they're not. So who are you? Oh, you're you're a normal person. We're just going to the loo. Can we have the people on duty any time now? There we go. Right. Timothy C should be on duty, and I would expect him to start mending things. Hopefully, unless that's a bit bugged at the moment, and they don't mend the great big cracks in the ground. Okay, but look, look, trains coming in. Two trains in the train station at the same time. Yeah, can someone mend these holes, please? Timothy C, it is your job. That is your one job. In fact, let's pay you both a bit more money to make you more productive about that. You guys are all okay. Oh yeah, you need a bit more money. You all need to be more productive. Let's just pay you all a little bit more money just to make you a bit better. Yeah, okay, I don't know how to mend the holes in the floor. I don't I don't know how to do it. <laughs> how do I fix this? Repair state. Someone come and repair it then, please. Repair this. Is there a button that I have to press to make them repair it? Is there some sort of setting that I have to press? Oh, no, I don't want to press that. I don't think there is. I just think they're supposed to come out and fix them, but for whatever reason, they are not doing it. And look, he stood there. He's kind of bugged out. He's kind of glitched just there. Who's that? Is that our guy who's supposed to be on duty? Yeah, I can't even click him. Look, I can't even click him. He's just sort of stuck just there. Okay, yeah, I think that's a bug. So, yeah, you should be on duty. Three till midnight. Okay. So have we just got to repeatedly just dis... I can't even dismiss him. He's just... He's trapped. He's stuck here forever. Yep, I can't dismiss him either. They've sort of bugged. They've glitched out, haven't they? Oh, that's a little bit irritating because now there's great big holes in the station and that's not going to look good for the platform, is it? That's not going to help at all. Yeah, I can't dismiss them. Look, dismiss, dismiss. I can't. I, I, impossible. Can we adjust their times? So... Two, and you can start earlier. Nothing. Unless that sprung him into life. Has that, has that sprung him into life? Or has he still stood there? No, he's still stood there like an idiot. You stupid man. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. Whatever. We'll have to deal with it, won't we? Right, let's speed time on. Let's go quickly. Let's see how much money we're making. Okay, not as much money as I would have hoped. So we're going to be making about 50 grand by the end of the day. Possibly a tiny bit more. 
as people come in and get the last trains of the day. Okay, so, oh no, okay, okay, a lot more. 60, 65, oh my goodness, lots of people going home very late. Oh my goodness. Okay, is this going to be our bumper day? Yeah, that, that's, this is our most profitable day ever. I didn't think it was going to be like that, to be honest. We're going to make 100 grand. Oh, <laughs> just shy of 100 grand. Oh, that's a shame. Right, timetables. Uh, okay, right, can I get the next track in? And then I'd have lots of options. Right, get this in. Diddly 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 do. Splendid. That's very expensive. That's very costly. That is also very costly. Go on, put the thing on the end. There we go. Now we've got track three. We have track three. Uh, build some platform just very quickly along the sides of these, just so people can actually board the trains, because that helps. Right, draw that down. Okay, good. Right, we've got platforms. That doesn't appear to have any yellow side to it, but it's... Oh, 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 it's on the other side. Ah, oh, for goodness sake. Uh, right, yeah, demolish, demolish that. Good. Right, put that in like that. Yeah, that's better. That's a bit better. <laughs> that's how it should be. Right, timetable. Uh, so now we can have track three doing that. Track one doing that. Track three, track three. So now every single train can come in. Every single train can arrive at our station. So that one can come in. That one, 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 that one. That one. Yeah, so one, two, three, four, five. How many have we got? There should be 10 trains, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, 11 trains. 11 trains. And they're all coming in. Why do I need the other tracks? <laughs> what good is that going to do me? Why do I need that? I don't really understand why I need all those other tracks then. It's a bit strange, but okay, okay, fine, yep, yeah, that's good. I'll take that, that's good. I'm okay with that. So let's build this down then while we're waiting for something to happen. Oh no, should we save our money? In fact, you know what? I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to save our money. Right, can we fire these guys? Yes, we can. We can fire them both now. Okay, they're both gone. Right, now let's hire them again. And let's just get both of them in at 7 o'clock. Just to see if that actually works. And they spring into life and start fixing the great big broken bits of our pavement area our sort of walking area okay so six is coming up to seven o'clock right okay are they going to be yes look that one's gone that one just vanished that one's gone right they're both on it now look oh now maybe they need two of them maybe you need to be both on at the same time or something right they've done it they have fixed the leaks that are the leaks the cracks whatever they are they've fixed the broken bits hooray for them okay Two trains coming in and going out. Not much in the way of monies thus far. But a lot of the money yesterday appeared at the end of the day, which is fine. Yeah, why do we need those other tracks then? Why do we need the other tracks? Because I can't have any more trains because that's the latest they arrive. Unless I unlock more trains later on somehow. What day am I on? I'm on... Uh, days to complete 51 leaderboard points 20 well 26 now it just went up there that's jolly exciting um okay i don't really understand what i need the other tracks for then why do i want to spend the money doing all that because so i'd have eight tracks is it eight i can have tops yeah eight tracks which would be expensive to build them all they're 15 grand a pop just to put these end caps on so why would i want to spend another well, that's at least another 60000 plus the actual cost of the tracks, which is going to be very expensive. So I don't know. I, I don't see the advantage in doing that. But okay, we probably will anyway, just for the sake of it. Maybe something later on unlocks more things for us, unlocks more uh, trains coming in. I don't know. Right, how's it looking? 42 and a half. Yep, it's looking pretty good. And it went up yesterday a lot at this time of day. It went up an awful lot, although not so much today. Not so much today. Look at that. Not much in the way of ticket sales. And it's going to be the end of the day. And bosh. Okay. That wasn't as much money as I had hoped. Okay. I think we... Do we keep that? Uh, what's wrong? Okay. Well, should we change it round? Why not? Let's just switch it around, shall we? We've got free reign of everything, pretty much. Um. Okay. You can be national. You can do that. You can do that. You can do that. That, 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 that. That, that, that. There we go. That'll do. Nice staggered approach. Two, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So track one only has two trains on it. The others all have three. Fine. Good. There we go. That's that sorted. Right. 
speed time on. Oh, now I'm going to save the money, I think. I want to get the food court thingy down here. I want to get a few more of these facilities in. I also do need to get some more restrooms in. They cost 70 grand. They're so expensive. <gasps> Baddies. Baddies. Where's the cops? Oh, seriously. Where are the police? On duty. Where is my police person? Where are you? Clara. Clara, the, can you do? Can you help? Okay, did she scare them off? Did that work? Oh, yeah, she's doing it now. Look, she's doing it now. She's getting rid of them. Clara, there's one here. He's vandalising the machines. Clara, yes. They t what does she do to them? <laughs> they just sort of evaporate. Does she just nuke them? She just sort of explodes them out of existence. Okay, yeah, I'm not going to mess with her then. She's, she's, she seems terrifying. I'm not going to mess with her at all. Okay, the control room is is in the middle. What can we do around the edge of the control room that would make it look nice? Do you know what? Let's get a few more places to sit. Why not? Classic benches. Just pop them next to the control room. People can come and have a sit down. We're going to put a big food thing here. There's going to be a big food area just here in front of tracks two and three. So we're going to have, when we can afford it, the food station... And then we're going to put in a fresh fruit stand. And we're going to have this thing as well. This food truck. We're going to have all sorts of stuff here. This is going to be a cool hip hop happening place. Uh, how about... Could we expand this bit and make the platforms bigger? Does that mean the trains can be bigger? Which means more passengers possibly? I don't know. Maybe we could see if that works. Like, how big can a platform be? Can you have a platform bigger than that? I mean, do you want a platform to go all the way to the end? I don't see why you wouldn't. Do you know what? That looks good, doesn't it? Uh, oh, why have I lost that on focus? Right, and then the same on this side. Let's just do it on that side. Like that. Bosh. Platforms all the way down. That makes sense to me. Let's do it for these other ones as well. Why not? Let's do it for the shorter ones. And that one. Uh, why have I got a bit of platform in the middle? I do not know. Let's demolish that. Splendid. Okay, right. Let's see how much money we make. Let's see how much money we make. Ah, <laughs> still not quite enough. And our maintenance guys, are they still stuck? Oh, no, they're not on duty, are they? There's a couple of things for them to do with. They're not on duty right now. Right, okay, timetable. Yeah, let's just stagger it again like we did before. Like this. That'll do. I'll just do that every day, to be honest. It makes it a lot easier. Right. Fast forward things on. You are Clara. So you're the night guard. Clara, would you like a bit more money? Would you like another 500 bucks, Clara, to make you a bit more productive? And Annie as well. Splendid. There we go. That makes it fair. That makes everyone else the same. Has the same monies. Uh, right. I'm, I, I can't get... I can't afford the food court thing. So I'm just going to have to sit and wait until the food court is available. Yeah, now that doesn't influence the size of the trains, does it? I wonder if I can do something with the size of the trains. Is there anything I can do to make the trains bigger somehow? So I can say, yes, please. Uh, I've got a, ma a massive train platform for this now. You can have more than, more than you know, the two, two carriages. You can have a great big train with lots of, lots of carriages. That was a popular train. Oh, crikey, that was very popular. Okay. Cool, that was good. I wonder if it's the city transit thing that's messing that up. I wonder if my city transit plan is not really working with the buses so people can't get to the right trains on time. I wonder if it's that. Okay, uh, 60 grand for that. No, right, what I'm going to do is wait to the end of the day, get the food court and get this bit sorted. I want this bit done. I want to have the food court stuff in and all the other foodie bits as well. And then we'll put in lots of lovely little accoutrements like information points and boards and benches and stuff. But we need to get paid first. Okay, so it was a good day yesterday. 79,480 in income, which is good. So we've got 134 grand to play with which means we can now build the stuff in here so here we go a food station oh that is gargantuan okay that's really big let's put that yeah, let's put that slap bang in the middle let's put that just there oh that looks very cool i like the look of that and then around the edge let's put just looking at it let's pop a fresh fruit stand in just there and they can, hang on i can hear people beating stuff up where are the police 
Yes, there she is. Go on, Clara. Go on, Clara. Yes, you've annihilated one. Yes, you've annihilated two vandals. There's another vandal over there. Would you like to utterly just eliminate him from the human race? No, you're going to let him go. I thought you were going to explode him with your magic police explodey powers, but nope, you've let him go. He's going to start vandalizing something. C C Clara, go on, destroy him. Destroy him with police magic. Poof, police magic. Okay, splendid. Police magic has destroyed lots of people. Right, okay, yeah. We want this over here as well. Let's have that next to him. A shoe shiner chair. Uh, and we do need some more lavatories at some point. We need some more restrooms at some point. Okay, why don't we... Oh, no, that's 15 grand. We're not going to do anything else. Uh, okay, some more benches, perhaps, along here. Just so people can have a sit down. Like that. Let's flip it round like that. Right, and what we do need is... This is a good point. We haven't got much in the way of trash cans around the place, have we? Which is why, possibly... There is litter. So let's put some trash cans in and around the place. Uh, let's pop one uh, just there next to the booth thingy. That makes sense. Possibly one up here as well. Nope, not there. No. Okay, there's some at the end of the platform. Look. Oh, that's quite a nice idea. One there and one there. Bop like that. Let's do that down here as well. One there and one there. One there and one there. There we go. I like that. Trash cans at the end of the platform. That's a good thing. Right. A food truck. Let's put one of these in as well. So let's drop a food truck in so the door is facing that side. Yes. So we've got a little foodie area just here. And what we do need is we do need some more lavatories at some point. Let's just build out this floor bit right now like that and have that going into there. Can we afford that? Two grand. Yes, we can. Okay, that looks a little bit more normal, doesn't it? That looks a little bit more normal. Right, now hopefully they will be getting on with this. And this will make us a lot of monies. Oh, did I do the timetable? Oh, yes, I did. <laughs> terrible feeling. We're going to have no trains coming in. A terrible, terrible disaster that would be. Right, so let's just see how much money we make. Now, this looks popular. Look, people are coming in. Are they just checking it out? Come on, it's open. Come on, people. Look, there's seats. There's comfortable seats with potted plants next to them. You know you want to go here. You know you want to go to this place and get some food. Yes, you spent $450 in that place. What What did you buy? What did you buy for $450? <laughs> Good grief. Okay, hopefully it was really, really delicious. Whatever you just ordered. <laughs> wow. Uh, okay, let's put some other objects down here as well. Let's put some stuff along here like... Uh, a clock, this kind of stuff, an information point, uh, and is there anything else that's not for information? Passengers feel happier. That's a good thing. Let's put some planters down like that. That's very pretty. Um, do I want to put one at the end there? Probably not. Let's put planters behind these three dudes. So there we go. So passengers can feel happy. There's lovely greenery around. Yay for plants. Can I put any along there? No, I can't. Don't know if I'd want to. Let's put one there. And on this side. Yeah, they should be okay, I think. They've got planter things up there. That's good. Okay, yeah, I'm happy with that. I think it's looking good. Oh, we could actually, do you know what we could put in? We could put in a snack vending machine over there. There we go. By the door to the control room. So people can, you know, go in and have more snacks. <laughs> they can come out of here, grab a snack, go back in and do more important train navigationing. I don't know what they do. Uh, there we go. 27 grand from vending. 28. It's going up. It's gone to midnight. Okay, right. Close it down. Don't click on a person. Let's do the timetable. That looks fine to me. That looks fine. Between 12am and 5am. I'm happy with that layout for the for the things. So, I think what we need to do is tweak the city transit stuff. So we want people to be able to get to here for 5.30, 8.30 and 11.30 for blue. So that. So let's clear all these. Uh, and these and these. So let's clear all the bus stuff. We need to do this fairly quick though. That's why we need a pause button. Damn it, the pause button would be good. So 5.30, was it 8.30 and 11.30? Something like that. So like that and like that. 
That gets those there. Right, okay. When does City Link come in? City Link are at 4.30, 6.30 and 8.30. So 4.30. Bring them back up. 4.30 for City Link. 6 and 8. So is that what time the bus arrives? And that must be what time it arrives. And National are the red ones. They're at 2.30 and 7.30. So if we go to National for 2 and 7, that should be okay. Now that and that can mimic pretty much. Oh. Oh, do they mimic? Oh, no, they're not the same. Okay. So we want 5, 8 and 10. So 5, 8 and 10. Uh, and... That's it, is it? Is that the only time they have blue? the blue trains or only in the morning? Oh, no, there's loads. 8.30 and 4.30. Oh, no. Oh. <laughs> I rather suspect I've messed up the city transit side of things here. So there's one at half three, one at half four, one at half eight. One at half three, one at half four. Yes, they can't get there for half through. That's not right. One at half eight. They can't get there then either. Right, let's put one in for there, for blue. Uh, yeah, that this is quite complicated. I need to see the train things as well on the same screen rather than to flick back and forth. National are easy because only two. But it's the other ones that are hard. Uh, 77 grand though. That's good. That's a nice profit. City Link 830. Can people get to City Link for 830? Yes. Can people get to all the other City Link ones, in fact? City Link. There's only three of those as well. 4.30, 6.30, 8.30. Can people get to City Link? 4.30, 6.30, 8.30. Yes, they can. National. Two and seven. So that can just be all the others. Why not? <laughs> because why not? Because there's only so many trains for those. Right, that thing and that one. Do you know what? Can we put that in? 40 grand city link trolley station can we connect that down here somewhere yeah let's put that there bosh there we go another link comes in so now we need to figure out when the green trains come in so they're late on so 4 30 6 30 8 30 so 4 30 you want to get it for four don't they 5 30 and eight there we go that should help i would like to get that as well I think that's, we might save up for that next time, get some more people in. So now I think by the end of this day, we should see a boost in tickets. We've got more people, in theory, coming in because we've added more. Well, we've tried to sort the buses and stuff out, but we have added more stuff. Oh, hang on a moment. Vandals. There were vandals and I didn't see this. Yeah, they're still there. They're still there. <laughs> vandals are still doing their thing. You baddies. Right, put those two in there. Put another one of those machines in like that. Splendid. Right, okay, everything's back to normal. Nothing to see here. Move along. Okay, so everything yesterday was significantly less in terms of ticket sales and vending. So our income was significantly less, which is a surprise because we put in this new food court thing, and there's litter everywhere, and, uh, yeah, and stuff around here, I thought that would have been... I thought it would have been vastly improved, but no, clearly not. Clearly that's not how it works. Okay, so I think what we'll do is we'll leave it there for now because we've done quite a bit on this one. We've got four lines in now, so four actual sort of tracks coming in. What do they refer to them as? Yes, tracks. That'll do oh no, I need to remember how I did this before. I've not set any time tables for the day. Yep, I'm on it, I'm on it, I'm on it. I've done it. <laughs> I do like that. I like the way it tells you. Little reminder going, hello, stupid, go and do the thing. Uh, but yeah, so we've done quite well. We've expanded this bit. We've got a food court in. We've got four tracks coming in. Don't really know what the advantages of having the other tracks, but we'll probably put them in anyway, just for the sake of it. Ideally, you'd want more trains. You'd want more of these trains. Oh, I can... Hang on. Three X. Three carriages. Oh, that's what it means. Three carriages. Oh, these are really small. Can I have bigger carriages? A bit more people on. That'd be better, wouldn't it? And um, yeah, I don't know how this works in terms of moving through time i've got 46 days left 46 days i don't really know what i've got to do what have i got to do <laughs> days to complete 46 but i can't remember exactly what the nature of the challenge was 
So j just build the station till it works? I don't really know. I can't remember what the nature of the actual challenge was. But never mind. We shall get there. So next time out, it'll be more of the same, I think. It'll be more of building this up. Maybe putting the other tracks in. Maybe getting these other four tracks in and sort of mirroring what we've done here. So I have two, two, two longer ones and two shorter ones in the middle. Building another food courty bit down here. Putting in the VIP parking because that might be quite useful. And then I don't really know. I need to go and check what the conditions of the actual scenario challenge thing are. I need to make sure that I am actually meeting them. If there are any, there might not be any. I don't know. But yes, we shall do that. Uh, before the next part. I shall check what I'm supposed to be doing before the next part. If you have enjoyed this, please do leave a like and also don't forget to subscribe to keep up to date with this series and all the other stuff that we get up to as well. But for now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard and I will see you next time. Right, everyone, give me your money. Give me all the money. The music is very sinister. I'm not sure I particularly like the music. Fire the catapult. Oh, what a shot. Catapult, man. Right, okay, they're knocking the wall down. They're not, the wall is coming down. Oh, God, some of them are huge. Oh, God, people are dying. Oh, it's lovely. I've got a watermill.